is key. The race for a vaccine is even more important. Well, French President Emmanuel Macron toured the headquarters of pharmaceutical giant Sanofi in Lyon this morning. Well, the drug company is working on a COVID-19 vaccine now and hopes to move to human trials later this year. Our international correspondent Annelise Bourges reports. As the race to develop a COVID-19 vaccine continues, France's President Emmanuel Macron got to see how the country's research is faring. During a visit to a development plant, the French president also got to renew his calls for a people's vaccine. I defend this vision that the vaccine be a global public good. Obviously, the work done on research needs to be compensated. That's logical, but we all need to fight against any form of holding back a vaccine. It would be unacceptable if this or that country, especially less developed nations, doesn't have access to whatever vaccine is found. Pharmaceutical giant Sanofi was at the center of a very public row. After CEO Paul Hudson said the U.S. had the right to get a COVID-19 vaccine first because the country had contributed the most to Sanofi's vaccine project. In February, the U.S. Department of Health and Human Services injected $30 million into the partnership with a French drug maker. But Sanofi has since backtracked on those comments and announced 600 million euros in investment on its French research and development sites. The cœur de Sanofi bat en France. The heart of Sanofi beats Notre in France. Et nos valeurs Our history and values are in France. And our future is in France, which is why we are happy to engage here to respond to future pandemics. For a while now, France's president has been advocating for any COVID-19 vaccine to be a global public good, echoing calls that treatment and vaccine should be made available to all swiftly and for free. But while some worry about access and supply, researchers in multiple vaccine programs, including here at Sanofi, have yet to develop one that actually works. Annelise Borges, Euronews.